Hello guys, it's Glenn from Sydney CBD or Power Center and today we have a Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 4 that doesn't want to open up. So we'll fix it right now with our Samsung Galaxy expert. So right now we're try to recharge this and look at that if you have a sensitivity to flashing light our apologies that's just how the smartphone is and you can see the hinge is not anymore aligning up so this is bad first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna remove the back cover so you have two back covers actually you have one for each part of the smartphone we'll start with the bottom one so it's usually the same thing uh, what we do with a uh, regular smartphone so we're gonna try to slice through the adhesive make sure we don't damage anything inside it and take our time we're gonna use this plastic shim now that's removed, we're going to proceed now to the top portion of the smartphone. So you have the top and the bottom portion. Try to be more careful. The back portion is actually pretty good, in good condition. So, And especially, we have this connector going to the main board. So we, we will remove that so that we can remove the cover. We'll use this cardboard box to prop up the device since it doesn't want to lay flat. We're going to remove the screws holding on to the covers for each part. This is the bottom part actually. We're going to strip it out with this wireless charging pad. I'm going to detach everything. Gonna remove some screws so the way we do this is we remove everything so you have batteries on both sides so we're also gonna remove that because when you replace the display on a Z flip 4 if you want to do it fast you just have to buy the whole assembly that means you have the display and the housing plus the hinge included so what David is doing here is try to remove everything from the old housing. Basically, remove everything from the old body and transfer them to the new one. So this is the battery on the top portion. You have the main battery, I guess, because it's the bigger one at the bottom part. It's just held on by adhesive, but pretty easy to remove but you have to be very careful because these Samsung batteries are very dense you don't want to puncture it or cut it in any way we're gonna take our time here there you go I'm gonna put that to the side So I guess this is the replacement display. So the replacement display already contains the screen, the hinge, and the connectors for all the components. So it comes with that packaging. You have the frame, the very sturdy plastic frame, all the plastics here just to cover up the internals. So all, you, all we need to do now is just to transfer everything. So we don't need to worry because David is an expert on everything Samsung. So this is just going to be a reverse process of what we have done in the past couple of minutes. I'm going to remove some miscellaneous parts. And we'll start with the main board. 
course, not gonna work. I'm gonna start off with the main battery, daughter board. So as we go along, we have to take into consideration the components that we need to put back in. Just to make sure that all the screws, all the connectors are accounted for. We don't want to close the device and forget to reconnect some connectors. Also, we're going to remove some miscellaneous parts from the old display and transfer them to our replacement unit. We're going to attempt the re reinstallation of the main board and the secondary battery on the top portion. I'm just going to close it up. There you go. Some tapes. And there you have it. So this is how a Z Flip 4 looks inside. So in the middle, there's just the hinge. And at the back of this point of view is the foldable screen, which is, I think, the best innovation from any smartphone brands in 2023. So Samsung is already pioneering this foldable display. Some Chinese smartphones are copying this. And 10 years from now, Apple will also copy this foldable design. I'm gonna try to turn this on. Of course, it looks normal when you look at it from the front. There's no crease on the middle. I'm gonna try all the usual things, components, cameras, buttons, touch screen, and of course, the foldability. Look at that. It would be nice if you can mod this with the transparent back. That would be awesome. But we're gonna reinstall the back covers. Course. This is not a project smartphone. This is for the client. I'm gonna put it all back. Look at that. It looks brand new actually. And there you have it. So if you want this kind of service, message us. Leave us a comment. We'll do the same thing for your Samsung Z Flip 4. Thanks for joining guys. Till next time. Cheers! If you want your smartphone fixed for a very reasonable price, you may contact Sydney CBD Repair Center. We also provide mail-in repair services for customers outside of Australia or Sydney. Just message us so we can arrange the shipping of your device.